Tom De Koning, TDK. We had to wait a little bit to see Tom play. Uh, that was disappointing and, and frustrating just because I think I definitely, and I think a lot of us do as well, we put him as the, you know, one of the cornerstone pieces to the future. You know, he's he is our future number one ruckman. And I think, you know, at the end of 2021, he's well and truly our, our number one ruckman, you know. Um, he played his first game in round 10 and then he played every game thereafter uh, obviously there was a there was an uh, like a, a chest issue um, in one of the later games as well but he, he didn't miss a game he played the 13 straight 13 for the season and and really I, I always looked at this year as a springboard for next year and beyond um, because he had never really strung together um, you know as many games as what he had in 2021 he'd come off seven games in 2020 and he, you know, it's very easy to get caught up in in expectations and, and whatnot. But with, for, for me, you know, for a guy like Tom, it, it was more about getting through this season and, and getting some experience and going up against some of the better ruckmen in the competition week after week, you know, month after month. And I thought he did a relatively good job. Um, it's still very early days. He's got a he's got a lot of growth to come, and, and there's no doubt about that. So I'm I'm not really. I'm not really in a rush with Tom. I think he's going to be fine. Um, I think he shows the the fight and the spirit. Um, there were some games early on. I think particularly against West Coast and and the Sydney Swans, some of the kicking, um, you know, didn't go his way. But he's always got this ability to, you know, no matter what happens in his game, if he turns the ball over, if he makes a mistake, he's got that. I don't know what you call it, like that self pride, or he he goes another level to make sure his next contest is better, and and that was really pleasing to see. I thought his marking game got better as he as he played more games, and just overall in the in the thirteen games that he that he played, I think within each of them, as he as he played more, he got better and he learnt more, and you know he just looks like a sponge at this point. That's just absorbing as much you know information as possible, and it's great. You know he's got, obviously got. Matty Cruz are working with him as well, who we all, you know, know and love and, you know, wish things had gone differently with with his career. But for, for Cruz to input some of his energy and intellectual property into Tom, I think it's going to hold him in good stead. I think Tom, at a base level, has got that competitive spirit. And you can, you know, you I don't know if you can teach that, but Tom has it. Um, you know, the body will fill out. He'll get more confident within it. I thought he, he put on... Uh, a solid amount of size, you know, for this year compared to last year. I don't know what the plan is with him. Does he does he just keep growing and, and keep putting on size? I'm not sure what the optimal weight range for him is in, in, and the way he wants to play because he's still very athletic and he still can get up there and, and take a big mark and and can leap. Um, but you look, it's he, he's one of the. I think everyone is important in terms of who needs to have a big preseason. But in terms of you know Tom. I think we do rely heavily on him and his position. Obviously, Mark Pettinet is there. The third ruckman is really up in arms. Do we do we go and get another one? Do we recruit one? You know, Levi Casbolt was playing that, you know, third ruck relief position on the list if needed. So, do we add another one? Do we add a senior ruckman um, to play as a number one ruckman? I'm not really sure. I, I think Tom's done enough to sh- to show that he can play as the number one ruckman. You know, come round one, we go up against Richmond. Tommy's there. That's that's the idea. I think he's it's a big preseason for him, and and I think he'll be relishing in it. And you know, fingers crossed, we can get you know twenty plus games from him in in two thousand and twenty two because I think he will just keep getting better as he goes. Um, as I said, not in a rush. I think he's going okay, but let me know what you think. How did you see Tom's season? Um, you know, what did you make of it? Uh, are you pleased with where he's tracking in his development? Um, and, and what do you picture with this ruck position moving forward? Do you picture us playing with two rucks in the side or do you picture us playing with one ruck? I guess it's really hard at this point, you know, at the time of filming, we don't have a coach. Therefore, we don't have, you know, a coach's philosophy to to go on. So we'll see how it all plays out. But let me know your thoughts in the comments and we'll go from there. Yeah.